Okay, so once you get the email back from me that has the video file in it, and it's quite a small video file, so the resolution of the video is gonna be quite poor, but in order to be able to email it back and forth, I needed to keep it small. Sometimes it'll allow you to see the video right within the email, and other times it just shows it as a file. It doesn't really matter. I'm just gonna go ahead and tap on that file so it opens it up in the player. And I could if I wanted, I could play it right now, and there it is, playing along, no audio with it, but that's the video that we're going to do. Uh, that we're going to add our soundtrack to. Let me just pause that. So to get that into iMovie, all we do is tap on the share button up here, and then you want to find import to iMovie. If that's not there, you might need to go all the way down to the end and tap on more so you can find it, okay? But I've already got it turned on, so let me just go back into there. Where is it? There we go. Import with iMovie. So I'm going to tap on that, and then that's going to take it from my mail and turn it into an iMovie file so that I can uh, start to edit it. There we go. Okay, so select the project. I'm gonna create a new movie file. Okay, so see, I've got all these other projects I've been working on, but I'm gonna create a new one. And there we go. Boom, my audio file has been uh, saved into here. So now I can tap on done, and I can go ahead and name that the Kiva video. Okay, so I've got it named, I've got it in iMovie, now I'm ready to go make my soundtrack.